Okay, RM, this is my end of summer look around. What I've been adding, I'm trying to boost my VHS, especially for horror right now. And next year, I will probably start collecting on Friday 13th. So, this is my good cabinet. I keep here Universal Monsters, Godzilla, and individual boxes. But once I get going on a Friday 13th around winter, I'll start putting them in the bottom row. I'll probably buy them individually, not in a big lot. I'll have to pay up a little bit on that. They're about 40 to 50 bucks each. But slowly I'm building up on my horror right now. I already have most of it on DVD. And a lot of these shelves I made myself from scrap wood. Just buy a box of nails for about 10 bucks. I don't need to be so wide like cabinet. Just enough to hold the movies so I when I go thrifting, I don't come back with doubles. Uh, do I need to buy stuff for Ace, uh, let's say Titanic? No. Do I need to buy stuff for Superman? No. Do I need uh, Jim Carrey stuff? I already got two of them. So, stuff like that, I don't want to get too many of, but. A lot of the basic movies I could find locally for like a buck, sometimes they price them up. Like if it's something good, I paid for each one for the Star Trek set $4.99. So, but I'm glad to have all of them and then later on I bought the set again for about six bucks, seven bucks and it's got the box but it's weird, it's like on a I don't know why. Then I collect stuff like Mr. Bean. That's another set that I'm working on. Got the whole set right here on the VHS, and there is a different set as well for Mr. Bean. So whatever you can find on Mr. Bean, Shirley Temple is another one. Double Seven is another one. The yellow stuff on VHS is uh, National Geographic, nothing great. I've been trying to get Dolly every so often. I've been meaning to watch Whorehouse in Texas. So I'll get that I'll watch soon. Just added Star Trek on DVD again. Trying to build up I Love Lucy now. A lot of the Star Trek I already have, Angel, I completed a long time ago, same with MacGyver. Then it comes way up here, that's X-Files, it's only got missing season 3, but I got it in a different set, so I might have to start collecting on that. Then I got the Atari, my music, mostly Dolly Parton, Pearl Jam, Kiss, and then some other heavy metal and country in there. Voyager is over here, MASH, and Doctor Who is over here. I don't have a lot for Star Wars for figures, but those are the ones I have collected. I still need Yoda, Chewbacca, and C-3PO, but right now I just want to boost my VHS and adding posters a bit at a time, but to print a poster without creases, they want 50, 60 bucks, so... Sometimes it's worth it, sometimes it's not, because they don't always line up if you're printing them by sheets. And this is the room right now, I've got two aisles to work with, and hopefully in a couple of years I could try to get Transformers, but for now... I've got vintage dolls, and I've got haunted dolls, because I've been collecting haunted dolls off eBay for a while, before I started boosting my movies. So i got quite a lot of old dolls. And hopefully in a year or two I could try to get some Transformers, but they're pretty pricey. And I need to get most of my horror on the VHS first, before I could go into something else. Brief look around, some Disney stuff, some anime. And whatever I could get, i try to build up thrifting and where you could get a good price on eBay, I try to get it, but I know eBay is pretty expensive with shipping, so... I always give you the shipping costs and the high price point of what something's worth. 
on eBay. And I might have to rebuy this set at some point unless I can find the missing season so I can complete it. Picked up Xena not too long ago. And yeah, this is it. Thanks for watching. My Barbies. Some more over here. I'll try to replace the shelf if I can because I cannot change the wood on it. It's just kind of built into the steady pace. So I would like to add like one shelf here, one shelf here. But I can't do nothing with this uh, wood, so I'll have to replace this one at some point. But I don't need it any wider than this for movies. So it's enough for me right now so I don't want to be spending money on shelving when I could invest it into uh, movies right now it's recently out of Pee Wee so I'm really happy about that I'll stop it here